Today on Cribs, we're headed to Slack, the startup that makes enterprise chat and communication software. Slack is headquartered on Fifth Street in San Francisco, just a couple blocks south of Market Street. It shares a building with Eventbrite, which we toured for Cribs a few months back. I met with Ann Toth, Slack's VP of Policy, to get a tour of the space. So we have um, a large open office space, as you can see. We have folks working at their desks over here. We actually have, uh, we split the folks out by generally speaking by their sound tolerance. Okay. So we have some folks who like quiet workspaces and some folks who like it a little louder. And when you have a big open office, it can be really hard to keep it sort of a low hum for everybody. Right. So we've just sort of grouped people by their, um, by the nature of their work and what they do and so that they can make noise if they need to or they can keep it quiet and work in a more sort of peaceful environment. So is this the loud section? No, actually oh. the loud section will end on over there. Okay, but good. Over here we have a variety of our engineering staff that starts over here and goes around the corner. And um, you guys have moved a lot over the past few months. It seems like Slack has been growing quickly yeah. and you keep kind of moving to new spaces. How yeah. long have you been here? What's the situation? So it's been a little bit over a month. We moved in April. Uh, prior to that, we were in an office on Folsom. Okay. Um, I joined there in October. I was around the 50th or so employee. And when we left, uh, we'd completely eaten that space. It was <laughs> unbelievable how we packed ourselves in. Slack's office is 50,000 square feet with 30 conference rooms and a large cafe area with a coffee station and a juice bar. We are entering into what for a lot of people is uh, the heart of any home and any workspace is kind of the kitchen where people eat and gather and hang out during the day. Oh, nice. You guys have, this is a good happy hour spot. Is that Jared Leto? It is, <laughs> if you want to um, come over this way. So, uh, so Jared Leto is one of the investors in Slack and also an Academy Award winning actor. <laughs> so he came by with his Oscar and that's Cal Henderson with Stuart in the background, uh, two of our co-founders with some extra um, emphasis added on the eyes. Yeah, the so, googly eyes really make it. Yeah, yeah, like we that. think so. You'll find some googly eyes on a lot of things throughout the building. It's kind of a little uh, a little Easter egg around right. here. We actually do a couple things over here. I wanted to point out, uh, this is our bar setup. So we have happy hour here every Thursday. We, we cater it. We make sure that actually one of the most important things is that there are mocktails for people who don't drink. Yep. So there's a little bit of everything for everybody. But one of the things you might notice um, people have gone a little nuts with the label maker. So right. this is our book about cocktails right there, uh, in case you weren't sure. Uh, the other thing, <laughs> breakfast, the most important meal of the day. This is awesome, and this is hamster food. So, you know, people are uh, pretty open about expressing their views on the various food items. Apparently, Special K with strawberries, very popular here. Big hit. Would you like a cup of coffee? I, I would love a cup of coffee. All right. Slack intentionally doesn't have nap rooms, foosball tables, or free meals. That's because it encourages its employees to experience life outside of work. The company believes that its staff does its best during work hours when they're able to really recharge. On average, Slack employees are in their early 30s, which means that more people on staff have kids and commitments outside of the office. I'll go in and then I'll come out dressed as a superhero. There you go. That's what's going to happen. Okay. Can you hear me? I'm talking. Well, I guess you can because I have my mic on. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so we have emoji-themed conference rooms. Every single one is has a different symbol, um, and we even in the, in the in our booking tool, you book based on emoji. So I can show you some. Okay. This is our training room right here. This one is Rocket. We have these lovely iPads that sit outside so you can book the room and see who's using it and when it's available next. Right. Which is very convenient. Very nice. Money bag. <laughs> it's interesting that it's such a small room. Then, yeah, well, you know, you know sometimes the, a lot of these are used for interviewing right, uh, or for right, phone right. screening and what have you, so they don't have to be large. Yeah. Sometimes you just need a quiet place to talk, and this is where you can get that done without disrupting your other colleagues. Totally. Okay hand. Yeah, right. right there. <laughs> Some of these emoji have different cultural connotations, I've discovered. <laughs> I didn't know. Okay I'll hand. look that up. Totally good here. Maybe not so good in Brazil, I'm not sure. But there's our thumbs up okay. right here. Um, and some of these are equipped with quite a nice audio-visual setup. We use Zoom um, to do conferencing across our different offices. And right, because you guys have offices in Vancouver yep. and mm -hmm. Dublin? Yes, we do. Yeah, so very global. We do. Uh, let me show you our bike space right here for storage. 
So uh, a lot of our employees here in San Francisco commute in by bicycle because they live here in the city. Yep. Um, we have a variety of different commuter benefits, but uh, but a lot of folks do really prefer to ride their bike, and that actually is also there's a commuter benefit associated with biking. Even we give you a little uh, benefit for that. So. People come in and you can see they, they hook up their bikes here. We have a shower. People can um, take care of all the stuff they need to right here. Yeah. You have a little baby seat on the I back know, of I'm bike. like, really you cool. know, you got some young employees here. I like it. We have some young employees. Young. We have. <laughs> no, the baby, doesn't, the baby doesn't come to work no. with his mom. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, it's nice that they commute together. I think that's really great. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for showing us around. This yeah. has been awesome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Cheers.